guys welcome to my channel today we're gonna do another plan with me it is not on Sunday <laughs> it is actually Thursday of next week my week was extremely busy and the first part of this week was extremely busy for personal reasons for me so <clears throat> this is how last week's spread turned out the new stickers that were added were the box washing machine and this little grocery cart and I think also this little clinking glass one. Those all came from print six and all the decoration stickers that have been added since the video have also been from print six. I really love the way that this came together. I was nervous about mixing two different kits but I think that it came, to very, came together very nicely. <clears throat> So let's go ahead and start planning this week, which is the 15th through the 21st. And like I said, it is Thursday, so I will just fill in everything that happened Monday through Wednesday and fill in what I know should be happening for the rest of the week. Also, um, I am filming in a different location and new lighting, so let me know if you like this better or if you like my other filming location better um, if it's too bright just let me know in the comments down below what you think and let's go ahead and get started with this all right so for this week I'm going to be using a kit from sweet Kwai designs um, this was separate because um, in the kit this is the sheet that's included it only has four half boxes and four full boxes and the way I plan I like to have it all the way across so I ordered this extra sheet and we have tons of things in this kit to use I'm gonna go a little bit different than what I usually do not too much um, not as far outside of my box as last week was but definitely a little different <clears throat> So I'm going to go ahead and use that. For washi, I am going to be using the Planner Kate bottom washi. I think I'm going to do this Sweet Love one because in the full boxes and some of the half boxes she has this pretty blue color. So I'm going to try and pull that in and I'm also going to use these hearts because that kind of matches this full box over here as well. And for my sidebar and to separate the weekend I'm gonna use this skinny colored um, blue washi that matches this perfectly and I'm gonna be using that this came from Michaels so I'm gonna go ahead and lay all that down and I'll be right back I love the way this looks with the little pops of this minty color in there I'm not a huge pink fan, so this really <laughs> helps me a lot. Um, so now I'm going to go ahead and work on my sidebar. And I'm going to use my usual Planner Kate uh, sidebar stickers, the Spend Miles and Work. And I think I'm going to pull this darkest pink in. It matches pretty well with... Um, this box these half boxes over here and most of this kit is very very pale so I think bringing a darker color on the sidebar will help a lot as for my thankful thought section I'm not quite sure which full box I want to use I may end up using this chevron because it ties in all three colors actually I think I am going to use that chevron um, I may not lay it down just yet. I may wait until I do all of my full boxes and see which one works best for the last one. That's crazy. I'm looking up at the viewfinder and this one looks completely white, but it's not. It's got tiny little hearts that are blue and pink all over. But the viewfinder's not, I mean the camera's not picking that up at all. <laughs> There you go, that's all the little hearts that are on there. It's not a white box. Alright, so that is how the sidebar looks and I am going to leave this blank for right now. 
So the next thing that I am going to do is I am going to use my date covers from Sweet Kawaii Design. And even though these are pink already and they don't really need to be covered, these little pink hearts are just too cute. So I'm going to use those as my date covers. And then I'm going to go in with my Libby & Co weather stickers and I'm going to place that above my date covers. So this is how it's looking so far. As far as the weather stickers, I tried something a little bit different. Instead of putting them all the way to the left corner of the day, I centered it and then I put the high on the left and the low on the right. I think I like that a little bit better than what I had been doing, so we'll try that out and see how I like it for this week. For Monday we had a thunder and lightning storm, Tuesday was partly cloudy, Wednesday was partly cloudy, today is sunny, tomorrow will be partly cloudy as well as Saturday and Sunday is fully cloudy. So now I'm going to go ahead and go in with my headers. The headers that she provides in the kit is two columns of to-dos, two columns of this and that, and then she has a bunch of random loved ones. So this is the part where I'm going to go outside my box. <laughs> and instead of pulling my Planner Kate ones, I'm going to go ahead and use these. I'm going to do my random ones that she has as the today headers. Then I'm going to use the to-do headers and this and that will be my fitness section. Now also in her kit, well under the today headers I will be using these full boxes with the to-dos. She gives you full boxes, one, two, three, four, five, yeah she only gives you five full box heart checklists. So, I'm going to go ahead and just use her heart flags instead. And then for the fitness section, I'm going to use these little half boxes that she has in the kit. So I'm going to go ahead and start with my headers for today and the full boxes. Okay, so this is what we have so far. What I decided to do was put this one up here just because I'm very OCD and I like things to have a pattern so I put the darkest color that she had in the full boxes um, in the center and then I did these two and those two and I was going to pull one of the chevrons but I wanted to pull some of the blue across and none of these there wasn't a second one of these and these two didn't have any blue in it so I put the chevron there and then I just pulled this blue heart one with the little red hearts in the center of them up here and I put the same washi that's down here up here to fill in the gap. For the headers I just went down the line. I did skip over because this one does say date night so I could repurpose this one for a night that my husband and I go on a date. So I just took this one instead and this one said you and me. So I have those laid down. Now I'm going to go ahead and go in with, if I can find it, here they are. I'm going to go in with these to-do headers and I'm still going to do the same color scheme. So she has three different shades of pink right here and I'm just going to continue that across. And then I am going to go in with these heart checklist flags underneath them. So now that that is all laid down, I am going to go in with the headers that say this and that for my fitness section. And as usual, I'm going to use the half boxes to denote um, what I'm doing or focusing on in fitness that day. And to fill in with the washi, I'm going to use these day washi strips from Planner Kate and I'll just use the ones that I use at the bottom, so the little hearts or the little uh, sweetheart love ones that were right here. 
and I usually use Planer Kate's water bottle but she has her hydrate stickers included in here so I will also be laying those down right above um, these half boxes and she also has these little weights and hearts so I'm gonna see if maybe I can repurpose them I don't know I'll see what I can do with these it may be cute laying them down on top of that we'll see okay so this is how <clears throat> it looks like with all that laid down what I did was there was a tiny gap between the washi and where these hydrate um, stickers were so I just took another strip of this washi and I just cut it for each inv individual day which I really like because it kind of like blocks off this whole section and I did go ahead and lay down the little weight um, stickers that she had and I put that in the middle of the half box I don't know if I really like it but I don't know it's down her stickers you can't peel back up after you put them down so <laughs> It is what it is, um, but I did write in what I concentrated on for each day, and now we're going to go ahead and fill in the functional stickers for every day. So on Monday, um, it was my brother-in-law's birthday, so I am going to use one of these, I think I'm going to use this sticker from Have a Parade, it has a little birthday cake on it. And I think I'm gonna add like a little bunch of balloons. This was from It's Planning Time. This was a breast cancer awareness sheet that I had gotten from her. Then also on Monday, um, my cat has been very sick, so he's on two different types of medication. One that I have to give him every day, so I've just been writing that as a daily task and the other one I have to give him twice a week so on Monday and Thursday so I'm going to use um, one of these stickers from Paper Loving Mommy and this one looks exactly like my cat Roscoe and I'm going to try and place it on top of these little workout stickers so I can use more of them since there's only one two three four there's five left um, so I am going to put that on Monday as well and see if I can position his face to cover up the little dumbbell or the weight, whatever it is. <laughs> okay, so I was able to cover the little weight and that's what it looks like. Um, then on Tuesday I had a big test that I had to take. So I'm going to use one of these little flags from the kit from Sweet Kawaii Design and write that down and I am going to put one of her little coffee stickers next to it because I had to drink lots of coffee that morning. So now that that is down, on Wednesday I do my weigh-ins. So I am going to use a scale from Nikki Plus 3 and I'm also going to use one of these little flags again so I can write down my measurements. So I'll probably use this one. Um, and this one. Also on Wednesday, I had to go bridesmaids dress shopping. I am in my friend's wedding, so I'm going to use this little heart from It's Planning Time. I had cut this up from one of her samplers. <clears throat> and I'm also going to use one of these little page flags to denote that on Wednesday. So there are several things on Thursday. First off, I have a build you. So I'm going to use this little build you sticker from Sweet Kawaii Design and I'll just cut that down to size to fit up there. And it is my um, internet bill so I'm going to be using one of these little Kawaii little computer stickers from Sweet Kawaii Design as well to denote that. 
So now that I have that up there, I am going to use another one of these little flags and I'm going to denote that it is my father-in-law's birthday today. And I have these balloons and this banner from It's Planning Time from the same little sampler that I got this little heart from. So I'm going to lay that down to represent his birthday. I actually decided to switch that. I thought the banner looked better at the top. So I put my father-in-law's birthday and his balloons there and then I moved the bill due down. And now um, I need to mark that Roscoe needs to take his second pill. So I'm going to take another one of those little weight stickers from Sweet Kawaii Design and another Roscoe sticker from Paper Loving Mommy. And I'm going to cover the little weight and mark that he needs another pill. Also what I have to do for today is I need to flam, flam. <laughs> I need to film this video obviously so I'm gonna use a play with me sticker from Sweet Kawaii Designs kit and then I also need to post last week's finished spread as well as this week's midweek update on Instagram so I'm gonna use a uh, Instagram sticker from Nikki plus three as for Friday, I don't have anything big on Friday, so <laughs> I'm going to use this sleep in sticker because I desperately just want to sleep in and do nothing after this week that I've had. <laughs> um, oh, and I forgot to mention, I used that weekend banner on Saturday and Sunday from Sweet Kawaii Design, and I used one of the darker ones. Tomorrow <clears throat> I need to clean the apartment so I'm going to use this little vacuum cleaner from Planner Kate. I think the colors match pretty well. Um, I also need to get gas so I'm going to use this little gas pump from Lisa Marie Plans. I'm sorry, Lisa Lorraine Plans, not Marie. <laughs> And then I also need to post another video, so I am going to use this little play button from Nikki Plus 3. For Saturday, I am babysitting like usual. So usually I use my peanut butter taco handprints, but these colors don't quite match. Um, if I had to, I could probably use this really dark pink one. Um, but I also have these handprints from Three Little Birds Studio and I think I'm going to use this light pink one all the way over here to denote that. And we have dance class so I'm going to probably use this light pink one to denote our dance class from Sunday Palm. So I also I decided to go with a darker pink to try to pull in this darker color over here a little bit, especially because all this was really light pinks. Anyways, so I also need to pick up some more medication for Roscoe, so I'm going to use this little paw print from Nikki Plus 3 to denote that I need to go to the vet's office, and I'm also going to use this little pill bottle from the poppy print shop to denote that I need to pick up his new medication. I totally forgot that on Friday I do have to make a phone call to my financial planner so I am going to use another one of these little workout stickers from Sweet Kawaii Design and I'm going to use this little cell phone sticker from Planner Kate and I'm just going to layer that on top and write who I need to make a phone call to and place that down on Friday. I also totally forgot that on Friday I need to do a deep clean of the kitty litter box, so I used another one of those heart labels from Sweet Y Design, and then I put a kitty litter box from Three Little Birds Studio on there. And last but not least, on Sunday I am going to film my plan with me, so I'm going to use this darkest pink planner with the last little workout heart. 
from Sweet Kawaii Design. And also on Sunday, um, my husband is flying out to go to training out of state. <clears throat> we don't know those details yet, but I will be placing um, a little airplane and suitcase and stuff on Sunday when we find that out. Um, hopefully I'll know soon, but I'll update y'all on what stickers I use on my Instagram. I do know that I need to go to the grocery store on Sunday, so I put a grocery bag from a Sweet Kawaii Design from this month's kit. And for the last thing that we're gonna do today, oops, last thing that we're gonna do today, um, I am going to decorate with these little um, hearts that are on the bottom of the sheet and also these little couples. So you got eggs and bacon and sushi and wasabi and stuff like that. So all, these are all the little things that go together. So I'm gonna decorate with that and then I will be right back. All right, so I went ahead and used all of the decoration stickers she had included as well as all of the hearts. I love the way this turned out, even though I'm not a huge pink person, I think with the pops of the blue in there, it really came together nicely. If you like videos like these, go ahead and give me a thumbs up so I know to continue to do them. I will list all the shops that I use in the description box down below, as well as any Spotlight and Etsy store videos that I have done on these stores. In the comments down below, let me know if you have any suggestions or comments for me. If uh, you would like to see how this spread looks at the end of the week, since it's already <laughs> past the midweek, check in on my Instagram. I'll post a finished look at the spread on Monday. If you use this kit, go ahead and tag me on Instagram so I can see how your spread came together. I would love to see the way that y'all laid this kit out. And if you would like to be the first to know whenever I post a new video, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Well, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope you have a happy planning. Bye!